Hey what's up guys welcome back. In this video I'm going to be restoring an old axe. So this axe was pretty beaten up. It was all rusted and the handle was broken so I decided to replace it and I had a scrap of oak that I made the handle out of. So I drew up the rough shape, cut it out on the bandsaw, and then took it to the sander to get some of the curves right. Here I'm just knocking the corners off to make it easier for when I take it to the bench to round over all the edges. After that I called it a day at the bandsaw and took it to the bench to work with some hand tools and I used some rasp, sandpaper, and files to really refine the shape. I would sand away some of the material then constantly check with my hand to see if it had a comfortable grip. Once I got the handle to where it was comfortable to hold, I worked on fitting the axe head to the handle. Once I got the shape pretty much close I kept checking it with the axe head to see if it would fit and just taking the high spots off where the metal would rub against the wood it was kind of easy to see. And then I just used a trim router to route out a groove to match the curve of the axe head. So I cut a slot down the top of the axe handle, put some glue on it just for good measure and then I glued on the wooden splines into the slot that will in turn hold the axe head to the handle. After that I just cleaned up some of the surface rust with some 220 grit sandpaper and a file and I was really trying to keep some of the patina on the axe head. I thought it would look cooler as more of a rustic project than something that was really polished and shiny. And off camera I used a water stone to sharpen the edge. I usually don't like putting a stain on my projects, especially something this dark, but I wanted to kind of have a worn out look to the handle so I put it on heavy by the end of the axe handle and by the axe head and where you would hold it it's kind of faded because I put it on lightly and then I sanded it. So 
So it's not the most exciting project, doesn't have much to it, but I'm pretty excited how it came out, and it's probably going to get some use. And if you guys liked it, shoot me a comment below, I'd love to hear from you guys. Give me a thumbs up, subscribe if you haven't already, and I will see you guys on the next one. Thanks for watching.